Okay, I turned off that nasty flash if you don't like the bright lights. It just helps me see you better. Can you show yourself? Maybe uh, the window. Oh, and then you did on the curtain. Thank you. Can you wave at me? Can you raise one of your arms up and wave? Even what? Even what? Oops, I got a... Uh, oh, and it disappeared. Shit. Well, that's more the reason for it to be a spirit. It, should be blacking out already. Are you spirits draining my energy or purposefully making me feel sick and in pain? It's not very cool. It's not a nice thing to do. I don't know why this room has glass where you can look at it. It's the Ulysses. Oh, I guess you can't read it. Ulysses S. Grant room. And I think that one, did they all say 1880? Maybe that's just the date of this. No, it's connected to the person I got. <clears throat> Pillsbury. Is that like Pillsbury Doughboy kind of Pillsbury? This is a cool place. Very nice people here. Interested in the paranormal. So if you want to go to a place to investigate, I would recommend the Murphy Hotel since they're very cool with this all. So. I don't know how active it is. I've never been here before. J. Pierpont Morgan. Never heard of that person. This one is Susan B. Anthony. Okay, cool. William Hurst. Definitely heard of them. There are, oops, did you see something? No? I'm going to check this other hallway here. Mr. Black Bart here, C.E. C. Bolton. Definitely heard of him. Horatio Algier Jr., never heard of him. John Crocker. That sounds familiar. Mark Twain, of course. Know who that is? Harvey Bled. No, nope, don't know who that is. Mark Twain Ballroom. Hmm. That'd be nice to go in. This one has no name. That's odd. I think we've got some bathrooms here. Shower for hotel room guests only, okay. Anybody sitting on the toilet? I'm not seeing too many stick figures other than the one that just appeared in my room. Switch around here with the hands because I'm getting tired holding this thing. 
Oh, don't shut off. Too early to be shutting off. And don't freeze. You froze. Oh, you bastard. Crap. I have so many problems with these Kinect cameras. I do recommend them though. If you do want to purchase one, get it from eBay. It's probably your <coughs> cheapest bet. Not that they're cheap. Ooh, that ball was lining up. All right. You say fantastic? What's fantastic? I gotta get ready for dinner. Is there anything you want to say before I go? You can speak loud and slow on this black box here. Specifically this little radio here. It's called an SB7. You're gonna have to stick me? What did you say? Can you say that louder? If you don't like me being here, can you touch the blue lights on that little black pyramid by the window? Do you see that? If you touch the left side, it goes green, and the right side goes red. So if you don't want me here, make it turn red on the right side. If you do want me here, don't mind me being here, make it go green on the left. That makes sense. Can you do that for me? So I can get an idea of what you think. I've never been here. Hello. Can you touch the blue lights on that little black pyramid by the window? It's underneath it. Touch the right side for red if you don't want me here. Green side left if you don't mind me being here. I heard a woman. Where's the lady? Ma'am? Change the batteries on this thing. I think they're dead. Hello? Agnes? Sound like you sung the name now, Agnes. That's a definitely old fashioned name. So that might not have been radio. I'm not really getting any radio here, being in the foothills. Partially why I have the antenna out. Normally I don't when I'm in the city. There's just too much radio that comes through. That's me. And it's hard to discern what's what. So. And these are not re rechargeable batteries. So I think I'm going to toss them. Alright. Made a lot of noise. If you don't like that, let me know. Touch that blue pyramid, make it go red if you don't like it. Hello? I'm not trying to make you mad, but if you don't like me, let me know. Hello, hello. Isn't that a, a song? Hello, hello. I don't know. Beatles. All right, I guess you're not going to say anything, so I'm going to say goodbye for now. I'll see you later after I eat and come back. And then I get to. What? 
I say do it. I'm gonna come back and then annoy you some more. Does that sound good? Actually, I think I will leave this on, give them some energy.